My plush campaign on Onash.com has now been extended to June and is currently limited to 100 plushies. So if you'd like to support the channel and you need more time to get the plush, well, now you got more time. So yeah, it's on Onash.com. Link in the description if you'd like to buy it. And like I said, it really helps support the channel. It'd be really appreciated. Uh, thank you. <sighs> Hi, Charlie. Hi, Sammy. Why do you sound down? Just a little sleepy. I think we stayed up a little too late playing video games. Yeah. Well, hopefully let's have a nice, uh, relaxing day. Good morning, kiddos! I hope you're well rested for today, because we're going to have an action-packed day with almost no chances to relax. <sighs> Me and my big mouth. Well, uh, since you two seem to be not objecting, Sir William and Springtrap and Spring Bonnie should be here, and then we're going to get started on our own pizzeria. Oh, that's cool. Charlie, you're gonna be the waitress. Uh, obviously, Fred Bear and Spring Bonnie and Spring Trap are gonna be the stage entertainers. And me and William will be making pizzas in the back. Dad, you know how to cook? Uh, I'm gonna learn. Ooh, pizza sounds good. Yeah, we can try some later tonight. After we feed it to all our customers. <sighs> That's great, Dad. We should be here any minute. <sighs> oh, hey, Spring Bonnie, what's going on? Spring Trap will wake up. And I can't find Dad anywhere. Whoa, wait, William's missing? Again? What is it with the other Dad disappearing so often? Oh, this isn't good. Do you have any idea where he could be? I don't know. I just woke up, and Springtrap hasn't woke up yet either. Do you think there's any way we could get him to wake up? Mm -hmm. I guess I could try a few things. Oh, what happened? Where am I? Hello? Jesus, man, why are you just scared so easy? I don't know, I'm just... Ugh, God, ghosts scare me like that. Ugh. Well, that's a little prejudiced. I can't explain an irrational fear. I guess I just have one. Anyways, where am I? What are you two doing here? Listen, uh, we're not trying to cause any trouble. We just wanted to ask you a couple questions. Questions about what? Like, uh, what inspired you to create Freddy Fazbear's Pizza Place? What? Do you mean Fred Bear's Family Diner? The place I'm building right now? How did you mess that up? I, I I don't know. There's been a lot of places over the years. We literally worked there! What are you two talking about? Nothing, but yeah, Fre Fred Be Freddy Bear's Family Diner, yeah. What inspired you? You know, what was your what was your tick? I don't understand. Why are you asking me this question? Oh, you two are like those paparazzi guys. Well, uh, yeah, yeah, we're the we're the we're the paparazzi. Yep, we're gonna we're gonna answer some questions. We're putting it on the Googles and the websites, and uh, yeah, we're making our own news article. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. All right, well, if I guess I'm being put on the news, I don't know why you're doing it in this kind of format, but... <clears throat> Fred Bear's Family Diner. Mm. Well, it came to me one day. I had a knack for creation and making robots. Felt like it was in my blood. Interesting. Well, I don't think it can physically be in your blood, but that's, that's a very nice metaphor for it. Ah, uh, well, I just wanted to create something for people. Something to entertain everyone. It just felt natural. It pains me seeing children sad. So when Henry came up with the idea to entertain the children of Fazbear Hills, he just felt right. It's like we were meant to be together. That's why he's my business partner. Interesting, interesting. Are there any other mm, ulterior motives at play? Oh, you're really gonna be in subtle. Ulterior motives? I don't think so. We're not doing it for money. I guess it's just out of the kindness of our heart. And we're also really bored. Hmm. Okay. One last question. How do you feel about kids? Kids? Like children? Well, I technically have almost never had any of my own. Of course, I created Springtrap, Spring Bonnie, and Fredbear, but they're not really my biological children. I guess one day it would be nice, but I've never really given it a thought. Perhaps if I find some nice mistress of my own, maybe we can start a family. Hmm. He sounds clean, David. Uh, yeah, I just wanted to be sure. All right, well, uh, guess that's it. Good. Uh, so where are we again? Oh, uh, I'm gonna use my special paparazzi uh, camera flash to to get us to, you know, back to your house. Oh, really? This sounds interesting. Yeah, just, uh, <laughs> close your eyes. All right. <laughs> All right, so he won't remember anything of what just happened in the last five minutes. What are we gonna do when he wakes up? I'll uh, we'll just take him to Fredbear's and, uh, you know, wake him up. We'll just say he got really drunk last night. What if he doesn't drink? And we'll tell him he did. I don't freaking know. Just come on. Okay. All right. Mm, I hope he's gonna be okay. Charlie, what are you going to do? Are you like performing an exorcism or something? No, Dad, I just gonna see if I can wake him up. Does that have something to do with those crystal things you've been into? Just let me do my thing.
Whoa, Charlie, your hand can glow. How are you doing that? Do you have like magic powers? What? No, uh, it's just I'm using a tiny little light bulb to see if I can wake him up in his eyes. Uh, He's up. Put that in my pocket. <sighs> spring trap. Oh God. Uh, hi, Spring Bonnie. Uh, uh, how long was I out? Since last night, I went to bed and then I found you and you weren't awake and you wouldn't wake up at all. Uh, what was I doing when I went to bed? Oh yeah, I remember now. I remember they said don't read page 78 backwards and I did it exactly that. Ugh, I'm so bad at this. But, Springtrap, what's that? I've been uh getting into the dark arts as a hobby. Uh, Springtrap, I don't think that's a particularly smart idea. What? I don't know. It's, it's fun. Uh, yeah, fun. Hey, I saw your room where you were playing video games last night. You got all those, like, crystal thingies. You're not much better than me. All right, all right, whatever. I mean, don't knock it until you try it. It's cool. Wait a second. Springtrap, Dad's missing! Huh? Dad's missing? You mean, like, William Dad? Yes, William Dad! Oh, jeez. What happened? I don't know. I woke up and he was just missing. Did your dark arts powers do this? Whoa, 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 whoa. I may have read page 78 backwards, but I did not do any sort of disappearing spells. That's a bunch of malarkey. I'd never be foolish enough to start casting spells without knowing what they do. And I love casting spells. I kind of got that point. Whatever. I'm experienced. Experienced maybe isn't the right word. I'm well researched. I swear to God, if you killed Dad or something, Spring Bonnie, don't get so hostile. Look, let's see if I can find some kind of thing to find him. You know, maybe there's a spell in this book that uh helps me find him. Uh, let's see here. Huh? What are you two doing? Why is William knocked out? We were questioning him. For what? We wanted to be sure he wasn't up to something, or he didn't have some ulterior motives for creating the pizzeria. He seems clean though. Guys, we wiped his memory off the grid. There's literally no way he could have had any evil influence. Look, we were just being extra precautious. Cassidy visited us last night. Cassidy? Wait, what did she want? She was kind of pissed that we uh, left her alone when we were doing this whole thing. I don't know, she's always been so grumpy. I just didn't think she wanted any part of it. That's what I said! <laughs> I'll be quieter now. Listen, she said she'd let us keep things the way that they are, as long as William didn't turn evil. And then she wanted us to do things, uh... Her way. What does her way entail? Do you know what isophobia means? No. I didn't bother Googling it. I kind of don't want to. Well, where's Cassie now? She's in the void, or whatever. That's her home, I guess, now. And she said if we ever needed us, Shadow Bonnie has access to the void, and we can put we'll drop William down in there if he ever turns evil, and then we can just fix things. I guess it's not a terrible plan B. In the 99.9% .9 chance that it won't happen. Yeah, let's just hope nothing happens. All right, let me get him up. What happened? Uh, Howard, is that you? Hey, Will, you doing all right? Yeah, I'm fine. What happened? You got real messed up last night, bud. Drank a whole lot. You know, we all kind of went out and had a little frat party. It was cute. Ooh, did I really get that tipsy? Yikes. I didn't know it was a party animal. So you really don't remember anything? No, I don't. Dang, that's a shame. Wait a minute. Guys, you realize his kids are, like, worried sick as to where he is, right? Oh, God. I'm gonna go find them. Oops. Yeah, I didn't really think that part through. <sighs> All right, come on. Okay, let me try this one. Here, Tay, Sam. Spring trap, it worked! Huh? But I'm not even done reading the spell yet. Hey, guys. Sorry for the scare there. I guess I kind of got a little wild last night. What happened? I don't know. Apparently, me, David, and Howard had, like, a frat party or something. I don't know. William, aren't you, like, the same age as me? Yeah. Weird. Well, at least everything's all figured out now. Yeah. All right, everyone. Take your places. Come on, Sammy. Coming. Ooh, ooh maybe my act can be reading kids' spells out of this book. What? Well, the kid's got a good sense of imagination. All right, uh, David Howard, if you'd like to help, you are more than welcome to. But me and William are going to go bake some pizzas. Uh, you guys just uh, wait on customers. Ooh. Do we even have an open sign on the outside of the front door? I hope we do, because I don't feel like checking. <sighs> Ooh, customers! Welcome to Fred Beer's Family Diner. I'll be serving you today. My name is Charlie. Huh? Whoa, this place looks cool. I saw the ad for it in the paper. Bonnie, I'm surprised you could even read it. Ah, that's harsh, coming from you especially. Yeah, Chica, normally I expect Fox to see those kinds of things. Do you mean say? Well, would you all shut up? We have to tell, talk to the nice lady here. Hi, my name's Freddy. Oh, hey, Freddy. Uh, is there a table for four? <gasps> all right, right this way. Yippee! All right, come on, guys, let's go. I 
think the tables actually look better like this. Yeah, you might be right. All right, guys, this will be your table. Yeah, I love tables. Me too. <sighs> Feel free to, you know, interact with our entertainment characters, and, uh, would you all like a pizza? Yeah, one well, large pepperoni pizza, please. My mommy's vegan, but I'm gonna eat meat, and she's not here to say no! That's the spirit, Chica. I'm surprised your guys' parents let you do this anyway. Why? Do your parents normally, uh, let you go out by yourself, Foxy? Freddy, I, uh... I don't know how to tell you this. Uh, I'm gonna go, uh, ask for the pizza. All right, I'm gonna grab the frying pan out of the... cabinet. That was unscripted. I just really didn't want that to fall. Uh, all right. Let's turn on the stove. One pepperoni coming through to bake. Ta -ta 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 -ta. Okay, get some browning right there. Let's get the salt out. Oops, that might have been the pepper. My bad. Eh, that'll be fine. Just have more salt to compensate. You guys doing good in here? Yep, going pretty swimmingly. Are you guys cooking pizza like it's a burger? What? I saw a cooking tutorial on YouTube. I'm surprised you know what YouTube is. What? I keep up to tab on the internets. Ah, I think this one's done. <laughs> yeah. All right, hot plate, hot plate. Oh. Thanks, Will. No problem, Charlie. All right, Henry, go get the ingredients. We need to prepare another one. Right. How many customers do we have? Uh, four, but they only ordered one pizza, so... Hmm, yeah, guess that makes sense. Don't forget to slice them up in four, four equal parts. We don't want them all, get, you know, getting upset over who gets what slice. Oh, no. I never got the geometry. <laughs> eh, I'll just guess. Can't be that bad. Old MacDonald had a farm, E-I-E-I-O, and on this farm he had a... Uh, chicken! Chicken! E-I-E-I-O. The singing, you know, the song is subpar, but I appreciate her singing. Aw, thank you. The wheels on the bus go round and round, round and round, round and round. The wheels on the bus go round and round all day long. This place is awesome. I want to see what this guy's all about. Oh, some friends. Uh, hello. How would you two like to learn about the dark arts? Dark arts? Is that like black paint and stuff? No, the dark arts is like mystical ancient spells. Uh, let's see this one. Uh. Poof! Oh my god, it's a fox! Oh, it's so cute! Aw. Man, I'm good at this. Let's see what else I can do. Hot pizza coming through! Oh boy, pizza! Oh, I'm hungry! <sighs> Me too! Oh boy! Hey, Charlie. What? Why did you cut it like that? What? Dad has to say cuts that told me to cut it in four equal parts. Holy shit, Charlie. Hey, don't say bad words like that. Uh, sorry, son. I didn't mean to. Oh, my God. They're going to think we reuse slices or something. What? That's ridiculous. Why would any restaurant train do something like that? Uh, I want this piece. Give me, give me. God, I can't my big stupid stub hands. Foxy, no! <sighs> Greasy, tasty, and it clogs my arteries. This pizza is delicious. And it gets some. Mm, 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 mm. Ah, youth eating terrible food. Charlie, can you let your dad cut the pizzas next time? I don't think that's how you're supposed to cut one. <sighs> Fine. <sighs> Howard and David told me that you should cut the pizza this time because I didn't do it good, I guess. Oh, honey, I'm sure you did your best. Yeah, apparently they said I don't know how to cut it in four equal parts correctly or something. Mm, you know, it's probably the fault of the modern schooling system. Yeah. I don't know how he doesn't realize I haven't passed first grade. All right, hot plate, hot plate. Cook the cheese this time. Uh, should I cut it? If you don't mind, Will. All right, all right, I got it. <laughs> uh, Will, are you gonna cut the pizza? Yeah, is there like a stain on the knife or something? No, it's, it's not that, it's just, hmm. What is it? This strange euphoric sensation. I'm finding it difficult to piece it apart. William? I don't like how you're freezing when holding a knife. Oh, um, sorry. Uh, you said four equal parts? All right, there we go. All right, thanks, Will. Uh, I'll be back. Will, are you doing okay? You were sweating a little bit there. It, yeah, something was just off, I guess. Why are you still holding the knife? Uh, I... I don't... I don't know. Would you like to go outside for a moment? Get some fresh air? I can cook the pizzas in the meantime. Y yeah, sure. Maybe it's about time I used a break. Of course! Anything for a friend. Uh, let's just hope I don't burn the house down. Yeah. 
Ooh, let me make sure I have the knife ready to cut some of the cheese and the pepperoni. Uh, did Will take the knife? Eh, whatever. I'll just grab another one. Uh, oh, that was good. <laughs> You're telling me, ready? Jake, I think you ate more pizza than the three of us did. Hey, just because my bib says let's eat doesn't mean I'm going to eat that much pizza. <laughs> Stop licking my face. All right, guys, I got a cheese pizza now. Uh, properly cut. Are you sure we should be feeding these kids as much pizza, Charlie? Uh, yeah, this will probably be the last one for now. Let's just hope some more customers show up. Yeah. William was acting kind of strange. In what way? I don't know. He picked up a knife to cut the pizza, and he kind of just froze there for a minute. Uh, it's probably nothing. Right? Yeah. Yeah. More pizza! Wait for us! Oh, God. Ugh. Wait for me! Nom 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 nom. Mm, not a nursery rhymes. Humpty Dumpty sat on the wall. Humpty Dumpty had a great fall. Ow! Oh, come on, that didn't hurt that bad. Mm, I guess it really didn't hurt that bad. And then all the king's horses and all the king's men couldn't put Humpty together again. But I can. <laughs> oh, I think the fox wants to sing something. Oh, yeah, I bet he's got a real knack for it. Come on, buddy, show us what you can do. <coughs> Hello, my baby. Hello, my honey. Hello, my right time gal. <laughs> I love the dark arts. This new feeling. It's different to me. And I'm not truly sure how to describe it. It's like something's flooding back. Did I? Did I hurt people? No. It's best not to think about it. Oh, hey, Will, you're back. I promise I didn't accidentally burn one. But why? Why do I feel like I'm angry with him? Will? <laughs> Go easy now. What are you doing with that knife? Huh? Give me that. You okay, buddy? You're scaring me here. Y yeah, I just... Maybe... Maybe last night messed me up a bit. Perhaps, perhaps I need to take the rest of today off. It's been kind of slow. We could stop making for the day. Maybe we should do that. Just rest up, and tomorrow will be different. Right? Yeah. Tomorrow is another day. Right. I'll get the dishes cleaned up. Oh, don't worry, guys. Kitchen's closed. Aw, I guess that makes sense. Oh, that was awesome! Thank you, sir. Do you own this place? Oh, yeah. Uh, can I ask you guys' names? I'm Freddy. I'm Foxy. My name's Bonnie. And I'm Chica. Guys, I hope you become regulars here, but uh, don't get too messed up on the pizza now. It's not good for you. You gotta mix in, you know, some salads and stuff. Don't tell my mommy I ate meat, please. She's vegan. Uh, your secret's safe with me, hon. Uh, it's getting kind of late. Let's go home, guys. Yeah. Thank you, mister. You're welcome. And don't forget to come back to Fred Bear's Family Diner. Tell your friends. Are you okay, mister? Yeah, you're really sweaty. Um, yeah, I'm okay. Just been a long day. Thank you for making this place. I trust you guys with my life. Honey. You know what mom and dad say? Don't trust strangers. I know, but they're so nice. Hey, Freddy, lighten up a little. Yeah, I guess you're right. No strangers to us. Bye, mister. Yeah. Trustworthy. So, uh, William, you doing okay? Yeah, I'm all right, Charlie. Just having a rough day. Perhaps I'm hungover. Yeah, maybe you're just hungover. What's hungover mean? Ah, uh, nothing. It's just I'm, uh, I'm catching a cold, maybe. Dad, we can't put cold in the pizzas? Yeah, I don't want to get all those kids sick. I'm sure they'll be all right. The heat cooks out the bacteria. <sighs> Anywho, we should probably take a rest for a few days, just so William can get back in tip-top shape. You guys did great. And as a special reward, I made you kids a pizza. It's a little lopsided, but I made it with love, so that's what matters. <sighs> Thanks, Dad. Yay! <laughs> Hmm. It's not half bad, Dad. Oh, you're just saying that. Charlie. Yeah. I know. 